There is an intense effort to get measles vaccination out to a greater number of people, in particular children who are the ones who suffer from measles and, and uh, many thousands die every year as a result of measles. A key bottleneck in getting more vaccines to people is that there's a lot of infrastructure and expertise needed to get the vaccines to those people in developing countries. Measles vaccine has to be given by injection, and so that means it's difficult to go door to door and, and bring the vaccine to the people who need it, but rather you rely on people coming to centralized health clinics and having doctors there who can administer the shots, who can dispose of the sharps safely, who can keep the vaccine refrigerated so that it doesn't get damaged. And this is a real limitation to getting the vaccine out to a large number of people who need it. We're working on a technology called microneedles. They come in the format of a patch so that instead of having to give shots to people, we've gotten rid of this needle and syringe. We have a patch that can just simply be applied to the skin. So you've gotten rid of the expertise needed to administer these vaccines. It's less than a square inch in size. You take that patch, you press it onto the skin firmly with your thumb, and then leave it in place for say 15 minutes. During that time, there are microscopic needles that have punctured into the skin painlessly and are releasing the vaccine encapsulated in the needles and the needles are dissolving. You've gotten rid of the needs to dispose of the sharps waste because the microneedle patches don't have any sharps after they are used. In addition, because of the, the cold storage needed associated with liquid vaccines, you now have a solid vaccine which doesn't have that requirement, so you can take it out of the refrigerator and transport it out to the places it needs to go. By targeting the immune system in the skin, we and others have shown that you can get a better immune response than if you put the vaccine into the muscle. After that, the patch is peeled off and can be thrown away in the trash. Uh, the vaccine has now been delivered to the body. We are now in the stage of, of progressing into human studies where in, in the near future we're going to be carrying out a clinical trial of influenza vaccination using a microneedle patch. It's been important to us when we have designed the microneedle patches that they be something that's not just a, an academic exercise here at Georgia Tech, but something that ultimately can be manufactured, ultimately can be used in medicine in an effective way. Not only is, is the science fun, but we do see an application at the end. We do see the opportunity for our understanding of the science to lead to something that could really make an impact on public health and, and we hope at some point save lives.